I'm back out on the river again today doing a little bit of detecting. There used to be an old bridge crossing the river here. You can see what's left of it. And I was searching around here to see if I can find some old stuff. And I just came across something unexpected. See that down there? It was showing up in the 80s. It's a cell phone. Unbelievable. I was thinking it'd be something really old. But it's not. There could be an SD card in there. I don't see one. The battery actually floated away. When I was digging the hole, I seen a little bag float up and went on downstream and I wasn't sure what it was. And that's when I seen the phone. Oh well, still cool to find it. I'm going to keep on searching out here today and I'll let y'all know if I get on to something else. I just got a pretty good signal down here. It was showing up as a 35. And check out what it is. That's really sweet. It's a Smith & Wesson knife. Alright. I'll take it. First one of the hunt so far. Let's keep on digging. It's a nice old pocket knife. Very cool. Still has the wood handle on there. You gotta love finding knives. Oh, I just eyeballed something right here. See that? That is awesome. But somebody was out here camping. They lost their multi-tool. Been there a while. Look at all the sand in there. I'll take it. What a beautiful day. You gotta love being out on the river in September. These rapids are pretty strong. Let's walk down here and see if we can find anything. Heading on down river. Oh, well, I'm pretty sure I found another knife down here. Looks like one. I don't know if you can see it. Unbelievable. I'm tearing it up on knives today. Wow. Nice Swiss Army knife. All right. I'm going to put it in the pouch. We'll keep on going. It's 5 o'clock right now, so have a few hours till dark. Found me some keys. They have been in the river a long time too. You can tell by all the corrosion on them. It shows up in the pull tab range, but that's not what it is. I actually see it. 
to watch. Pretty cool. First watch of the hunt. Hadn't found one of them in a while. This one looks really old. Another knife. Wow. That is so cool. This one is showing up as a 50s to a 60s signal on AT Pro, which is right around pull tab to nickel range. It was bouncy though, so I knew it was something iron. That's cool. Might be able to get it open. Well, I just located a pretty good signal down here. I want to let y'all listen to it before I dig it up. It's a very strong signal. Pretty big. Sounds like it. I can raise the coil a good five or six inches and still pick it up. So it's a bigger target. 90s. But it's got a little grunt to it. So it's probably iron. Let's go down and see if we can find it. Hmm. Unbelievable. Another knife. Man, that thing is old. Never seen anything like it. it. Has a stainless steel blade. Not sure what the handle's made out of. Looks like there's some wood in there. Wow. There are so many knives out here. It's unbelievable. It's like, why does everybody bring their knife on the river and lose it? I don't know. But I'm going to have a nice knife collection for the day's over. <laughs> I'm going to have to get a bigger pouch, I'm telling you. Running out of room again. You're probably not going to be able to see this, but there's deer crossing the river. They're a good hundred yards away from me. Look at them, look at them. They're fighting each other. I'm zoomed in about as far as I can get. I've been sitting here watching them cross the river. That's cool. I'm getting ready to head on back to the truck. I've had an amazing day. Found a bunch of stuff. It just gets dark a lot earlier now. I probably have at least a 30 minute paddle back. And I'll have to load everything up. These are all my finds from the river yesterday. Had an awesome hunt. I stayed out for about 10 hours. 
Found over $11 in coins. Have a bunch of knives. This one here is a butterfly knife. Made in Chicago. Broke apart when I found it. So I guess it's been in the river a long time. I tried to open this one. But the blade's too rusted. Also have a lighter. Could be a Zippo. Haven't cleaned it up yet. Bunch of keys. I always find a lot of them. There's my watches. This one here might still work. Have some type of charger. Cell phone. And a bunch of sunglasses. Let's go over here and take a look at the trash. Lots of aluminum on this hunt. That place was just littered with junk. So I hope y'all enjoyed the hunt. Thank you for watching. And before I go, just wanted to give y'all another heads up. I'll be down in Concord, North Carolina on October 28th and 29th for the 2017 GPAA Golden Treasure Show. So if any of y'all are in the area, feel free to come on down to the show and check out the Battleground Detectors booth. That's where I'll be. And also have a special guest with me, Relic Recoverist. Y'all have safe travels, and God bless.